Hey guys, it's Nerdy Nisi, and today we are taking this video back for a little throwback and doing another episode of Comic Book Monday. We haven't done one of these in quite some time because frankly, I haven't been buying comic books. Oh, Bucky, are you okay? Uh, so, uh, Bucky Barnes, my hot toy here, is here for a special reasons. Uh, but um, first, I do want to go ahead and say uh, this Comic Book Monday is a little bit special because, one, we have not just comics, um, but uh, my comic book store had 50% uh, off their Blu-rays, comics, um, CDs, and DVDs, um, and then pretty much everything else in the store was 15% off. So I was so excited for this. So I got some Funko Pops. I got some Blu-rays, and of course, for Comic Book Monday, we gotta have the comics. So first off, I'm gonna show you the Blu-rays that I got because um, I am thinking about doing this uh, series on my channel. If you haven't seen my room tour video, there'll be a link right up there or right over here somewhere. Um, also in the description below, I did mention I wanna start doing like a, a series because I haven't seen all my Blu-rays. Uh, and so I figured I'll pick a Blu-ray or pick a movie and we'll talk about it once a week just so I can get caught up on my movies. Um, so, got some new stuff, but pretty much these I've already seen, but we can also talk about these as well. Uh, so first thing I got, uh, I got because I uh, heard things about it and I'm kind of interested about it. Um, so I got season one of True Blood. You can see the price there, $5.99. Got this for 50% off, so about $3. Um, $3 for a Blu-ray of a series? Why not? I'll go ahead, give it a, a watch, and see how I like it. I don't know when I'll watch it, though, to be quite honest. <laughs> so um, Next, we got season one and two, pretty much the whole series of Pushing Daisies. Now, I don't know if this speaks to the quality of the show because True Blood is $6 and then Pushing Daisies is $14.99. It could be because it's not a show on TV anymore, but True Blood is the same thing. I don't know. I just really love this show. I used to watch it, Ned the Pie Maker, and I uh, love it. I love the premise. If he touches you when you're dead once, you get back to life, but he touches you a second time and you gone for good. Love this show. I do wish they made a continuation of it, even a movie I'd be happy with, um, but I'm definitely happy to have season one and two in my collection now. Okay, these movies I have all seen. So first we'll start with Quarantine. Um, Six dollars, so got it for three dollars. I love this movie. It's so weird, but I really do like it. I have not seen the Spanish version, Wreck, um, and, but I have seen the sequel, Quarantine to Terminal, um, and I figured, you know what, I do kind of enjoy this movie, so I'll go ahead, have this in my collection for three bucks, not bad. Uh, this one I like because Timothy Oliphant, me, Lee. Um, and this is a perfect getaway. Also got for three bucks because of the 50% off. Um, Mila Jovovich, hopefully I'm pronouncing her name right, um, from Resident Evil is also in this. Um, but yeah, mainly because Timothy Oliphant loved them in Scream 2. Um, the Santa Clarita Diet and some other miscellaneous stuff that he has done. So yeah, love this movie. Uh, again, my taste in movies is kind of not the greatest, I guess. I could really love a really bad movie. Um, <laughs> next, we have The Call. Um, I actually did kind of enjoy this movie. and um, I only saw it once, so I was like, you know what? I kind of want to watch it again. So if it's a movie, uh, I, like I might as well just buy it. Uh, so this was $5. Got it for $2.50. Great. I love sales, guys. I really love sales. And then this one, I have talked about this um, in a video before, and that is Starship Troopers. Got it for $4. 
Um, I said in a previous video, the I think it was the Tanker Bug video I did, I watched this movie before bed for like an entire year. I don't know why it was like a routine, like OCD. I had to watch this movie before bed. Um, and I, I'm scared of bugs. Like I'm scared of these bugs. I never want to see them in real life. I even hate snakes and spiders, like little bitty ones. Um, but um, I don't know why I had to watch this movie. So I really liked it. Um, I haven't seen the sequels but i know that they're coming out with more starship trooper funko pops and that makes me happy because i got johnny rico i got the tinker bug i need to rest okay guys so i'm going to show you the funko pops last because that's behind the comics here so just one uh well four comics but it's one set and i haven't gone to the comic book store that much I actually need to like make a list of all the comics I am collecting because I, I just kind of take a look around and sometimes I do miss stuff. Um, but the reason why Bucky Barnes from Endgame is here is because um, I got the series one through four of Falcon and the Winter Soldier. So I am excited to read this. I'm, I know it's not affiliated, like, it's definitely not going to be the sto same storyline as the, 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 the show Falcon and the Winter Soldier, but these two characters I love, 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 obviously why I got the hot toy, um, and I'm excited to read this. So, um, I will definitely be taking a look at this. I did glance through, um... Uh, the first issue, issue number one, and it just, it captivated me. And that's another reason why I got it. It's because when I was browsing through, I, I thought it was awesome. So issue number one through four of The Winter Soldier is now in my comic collection, guys. I definitely need to make sure I also mark down when issue number five comes out. And also mark down what other comics I have. Or need to get, I should say. Then I can make more episodes of Comic Book Monday for you guys. Uh, so these issues were 50% off. So that's still amazing. These Funko Pops though were 15% off. That's alright. I love sales um, and getting a good deal. So first thing I got. I got the Harley Quinn with the, uh, the, the, what is her? Uh, oh my gosh, I'm just blanking out the uh, the hyena um, helper. <laughs> um, so I, I'm not a huge fan of getting like holiday pops. I don't know if I said this in a video before, um, but like I don't get like the Star Wars uh, holiday stuff. Like instead of him, uh, Darth Vader holding a lightsaber, he's holding a candy cane. I, I'm not a huge fan of getting holiday pops, but... I did justify this one. I am a huge Harley Quinn collector, as you can probably tell from my Harley Quinn <laughs> collection right here. Um, I did buy the Valentine's Day Harley Quinn. Technically, my dad did for me. And so I justified that, but if I get the Harley Quinn Valentine's Day, I'm okay to get the Harley Quinn Christmas one. Uh, so I did get this one, um, and I almost, like, Almost got the Jack Frost Joker from Target, but I was like, I'm going to go down that slippery slope if I get that. Harley Quinn will do it for me, for my collection. So guys, I did get uh, Harley Quinn. She looks like an elf, and it looks beautiful. Beautiful, guys. Uh, instead of uh, red and blue in her hair, it's red and green. I really like it. Mistletoe on the, the hair. Um, looks like an elf. I absolutely love this one, guys. I'm so, so happy about this. Uh, yeah, very happy. Okay, so I'm going to put this here. Okay, so these three, I got four pops, um, but these three is a part of a set. And if you've seen my room tour video, again, it'll be up here or down in the link. Um, if you've seen that, I did mention that I have a baseball bat. Um display things and one of those I think I'm going to do for my Pokemon so 
I got these, and if they make all of the evolutions, I will be happy. Uh, but I had to go with the OG3 and get those. I got Jolteon, Vaporeon, and of course, Flareon. Um, now, I love the evolutions. I want all of them, and that's another reason why I got Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. Um, but I think my favorite out of all of them, I think, has to be Flareon. Vaporeon comes in a close second, guys, but I love Pokemon. That's why I'm also doing, um, uh, I don't know if it's up yet or what order I'm going to do this. Uh, but I am doing opening up the digital packs for Pokemon because I have a lot of them. And uh, yeah, I love, love, love Pokemon, guys. So I, um, that is it for this episode of Comic Book Monday. I know I'm not going into a deep dive um, with the Falcon and the Winter Soldier. And I did have more. But Comic Book Store Monday? So, uh, yeah, guys, if you like this video, of course, give it a like. It definitely helps me out that you guys know that you, that you guys like this type of content. If you aren't subscribed, go ahead. Hit that subscribe button right there somewhere. And um, it, don't forget to hit that notification bell, and you'll be notified whenever a new video pops up. You can follow me on my social media. Both my Instagram as well as my Twitter is at NerdyNacy. And guys, I am also streaming on Twitch. If you want, guys want to see more Pokemon, I do play Pokemon uh, Pokemon Sword on my Twitch. And that is twitch.tv forward slash nerdnisi. That will also be in the description below as well as right here. And guys, as always, I will see you guys in the next video. And keep staying nerdy. Bye-bye.